Hey, Val, sweetie. I'm home. Listen, I'm so sorry I couldn't get an earlier flight. Oh, hey, my love. Don't worry, I'm so glad that you're here. Oh, I just wanted to meet this little angel. Yeah, and don't worry. The important thing is that you're here already with us. So how you been? Good. You know what? I just need to meet my son, my little angel. How are you? No. Hey, no. What is this, Val? What is, is this some kind of, kind of a joke? What is that, Val? <laughs> that is not my son. What's happening? You tell me right now what's happening. Eduardo, how can you say that? He's our son. You know goddamn well what I'm talking about, pal. That cannot be my son. That can be anyone's but mine. Apparently, while I'm out there working my butt off, well, I, apparently while I'm out there working my back off, you're, you're laying around. That is not my son. What? Yeah. Whose kid is that? Whose kid is that, Val? Look, look at him. Look at him. Now look at me. Do we look alike? I cannot have a kid with that skin color. How dare you to even say that? How dare I? How dare I? You know perfectly well. You have been the only man in my life. And I can't believe you won't accept your kid just for his color. That's goddamn right. I'm not accepting that as my son. And more so knowing that he injured his color from your father? Oh, we do not talk about my father. You do not talk about my father. The only thing I've ever wanted in my life was a son. I pray to God every day and every night for a son. And now you come with me with this, this nonsense. That is not my son. That's not my kin. Now get it through your head. Get it through your head right. That will not be my son. Not now, not ever. I will never, I will never accept that thing as my own. You know what? I believe it's just best that I get out of here. I get out of your neck and your son and whoever the father is. I don't need this. No, 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 no. Don't, don't leave us, don't abandon us. He's your son. My son. I swear you, Eduardo, he's your son. No! Hi, Dad. Hey, you ready? Yes. Okay. Oh, here, count them. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Okay. And? One, two, three, four. <laughs> okay, again, again. No, no, your turn. Okay, oh. ready. None. One, one, two. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm not in that age anymore, oh, son. Come on, Dad, it's okay. Okay, let's rest for a bit. Yeah. Listen, you can achieve anything you want in life. Anything you could ever dream or wish, you're gonna make it. You're the best that life could have given me. I mean, I, I couldn't understand how you accept me like your own son and for everything you have given me and taught me. Son, I'm always gonna be supporting you no matter what. Come on. <laughs> Thank hey, you, hey, how are my two trucks doing? <laughs> well, look at us. That's great. I brought you some water. Oh, to my love, up. you're the best. And back home, because I made some burgers that mm. are finger licking delicious. You'll see. <laughs> Our favorites. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's I'm go. So go starving. You must be too. <laughs> <laughs> you're looking damn fine, sugar bunny. It's a good thing I'm back in town. Time we rekindled our love. It's time I give back what's rightfully mine. Damn right. Goddamn right. Be careful, my love, and don't come back late. Remember that today is my June's birthday. He turned 15. Of course, my love. I have it in mind. <clears throat> How can you think that I wouldn't notice my big boy's birthday? But well, I'm going to be late, so I have to go. Yeah, sure. Have a good day. You bye too. Bye. Bye, princess. Hey, pal. I don't know what are you doing here? Huh. It's a long time no see, my little bunny. How you been? I mean, have you missed me? Have you missed me at all? Because I know I have. I have a lot. You know what? I want you back. No! Let go of me! Okay, don't you dare to come closer again. What's wrong with you? Why are you yelling? Just shut up and let me speak. 
I need to say this. I know, I know you started a new life. I know you, you married that thing you call a man. I know all this, but hey, I just want you to know I'm here to get you back. And I know that he, he is John's real father. The son you tried to fall upon me 15 years ago. Huh? I don't care. I don't care anymore. Does he touch you like I used to touch you? Does he kiss you the way I did? I don't think so. You know what? I don't care. I don't give a shit about that man or any other man. I'm here to take you back and I'll do whatever it takes. I will never, never come back with you. But you will. You will. You damn feet. Hey, you watch your goddamn tone. Yeah, you're right. My son has a father. Someone who loves him, even though he doesn't have his blood. You, you're a coward. A coward? I'm a coward, huh? We'll see who the coward is once he knows who his real daddy is. All right? Blood calls upon blood. Get the hell out of here! And don't you dare to come back. If not, you will regret it. Huh? Regret it? That boy's mine. Blood calls upon blood. Oh, he'll find out. He'll find out soon enough. Hi, right. man. Congratulations, man. You did good. Hey, thank you, bro. See you tomorrow, right? See you tomorrow. See you, bro. Oh. Uh, nice. Hey there, John. Hey. Oh. Well, I guess congratulations are in order. Hey, <laughs> who are you? A little birdie told me that today was your birthday. So here, I uh, got you a little present. Uh -huh. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> Thank you, but I still don't know who you are. Yeah, well, John, be... sometimes the truth hurts. The, the person you call daddy, the person that lives in your house right now, now he ain't your kin. He ain't your family. He's not your real daddy. I am. Uh, I am. What? Yeah. Are you the man who abandoned me 15 oh. years ago? Oh, man, John, I did not abandon you. I did not abandon you. Now look, I'm here to speak the truth. I'm here to rekindle my family. That's you. That's you right there. That thing you've got there, the blood pumping through your heart, that's mine. All right? You better get that through your thick skull. Nah, your mama played us. She played us both. She's been planning this for the, from the get-go. You understand me, John? But my mom is a role model for me, and my father is, is an honorable man. <laughs> he, he gave oh, me his man. last name. He did not give you his last name, John. He stole it. He stole my last name. The one that should be yours. Okay, uh, listen. This is too much for me. I, I'm so confused, okay? I've always wanted to know who's my real father, and. All this you're telling me, I, I don't know, no. I know it is, John. I know it is, but we gotta do something. We're family, you and me. No, wait. You know what? Here. Take this. That's my information right there. Phone number and address. Anytime, anytime, any questions you might have, whatever, just give me a call. You get your mama to that address as soon as possible. So we could be together. All right, kid? Come on. Go on, get. Get going, get. Go on. Why did you lie to me? Lie? What are you talking about, son? I already met my real father, Eduardo. He told me all the truth. You, alongside my mother, lied to me. You know that he was trying to see me and you took me away from him. You took me away from my own blood. No, no, no. Eric and I, we are your only family, okay? That man that you say you're man is an idiot. A coward who abandoned us the day that you born, okay? Just for your skin color. Oh, my love, you can't believe in him. No, 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 liar! You're a liar, mom! You cheated on my real father! That's why he didn't believe that I was his son! Because you used for, to go from bed to bed when he was out on a business trip! Hey, stop! Don't talk to your mother like that, okay? 
What? Not you going to hit me? And you called yourself my father? You're miserable. Both of you! Right now, I'm living. Come no, 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 John, no, 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 no. John, what are you doing? Come here. Who's that? Who's that? Hello, Dad. What the hell are you doing here, boy? Well, uh, I couldn't stand living with that people who lied to me all my life. I want to start a new life with you, my real father. Wait, hold on. Where is your mom? Um, uh, well, I'm afraid she's not in our favor. Uh, she doesn't want us together, and uh, we can't allow them to, to separate us again. You know what? I believe you must be real confused right now. Because this, I got no need for you. Without your mama, without my bunny, you're nothing to me, all right? This is not a negotiation. No bunny, no you. So I guess it's best you get, you get going right now, yeah. You get going. I don't need you here right now. I don't need you here ever. Understood? I was so stupid. I, I don't know how I could. Believe in you instead of my family. Yeah, you were pretty stupid. Very stupid. Mom was right. You're a coward. I may be a coward. An authentic coward. You know why? All my life, I've been dreading, dreading to raise a bastard like you. I don't need this right now. Now you go on, get out of here. Go on, get! Do not come back without your mother. That's it, go on! Get out of here! You're a coward, Dad! Yeah. I don't want to see you again in my life! Yeah, go on! Go on! Please, Carlos, if you see him, call me right away. Don't hesitate on calling me back, okay? Hey, go up and call John. Check if he answered his phone already, please. Okay. Son, son, we were so worried about you. Where, where you been? Oh, my God. Son. Oh, son. It's so good that you came back. We we're so worried about you. Hey, hey, look at me. I don't deserve those tears. You were right. Eduardo used me. He used me. And I'm so grateful. No, forgive me. No, 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 no. There's nothing to forget about. Your family, your real family. We're always going to be here for you, okay? And John, even though I'm not your birth father, for me, you are always going to be my son, okay? I already, I already want to be with, with my real father. The father who loved me since I was a child. The one who saw my first steps. The one who taught me how to ride a bike to, to play football. The one who, along with my mother, watched out my, my dreams at night when I was sick. The one who loved me and admired me regardless of my skin color. The one and the man who I admire most in my life. Eric, my real dad. There are ties that are even stronger than blood itself. Ties that unite hearts even without being related. Ties that nothing or no one can break. <laughs>